Welcome to Two Minute FNI with Deal of Profit Services. I'm Mike Chappell. We're talking integrity. So, look, I think we know that integrity is a, an issue in the FNI um, department in general, and we hope that it's not an issue. But it, if we're really honest, every one of us at some point in time, whether we're dealing with a salesperson or dealing with a bank or we're dealing with a customer, we, we know that integrity uh, it comes up. You're tempted. You're tempted to uh, skirt an issue not fully disclose something. You're tempted to not completely look out for the dealer when the salesman's bringing you things that maybe be a little questionable. Um, dealers, you know, obviously you don't want an integrity issue. Finance people, I hope that you don't want to sacrifice your integrity. But the reality is, is we need to be looking at integrity in all directions. Do we truly 100% trust the people working for us? I certainly hope so. But if we ever start to get those feelings, investigate. If you ever start to feel like the customer might have been misled, uh, clarify. And obviously on our own part with banking relationships and disclosing uh, products, services, things of that nature with customers, there's zero tolerance, zero um, leeway when it comes to integrity because in the end, it's always gonna cost us far more than any lapse of judgment would gain us in our integrity. So let's just keep that in mind Shouldn't have to have this video, but I really think it's important to at least bring it to mind. Dealers, finance people, if you think that someone around you isn't looking out for the dealership's best interest, most likely they're not, and it's probably worse than you think. So just be aware.